Chapter 39. You've detached head. Now what? If at any time you check out something that is not the tip of a branch, for example an older tag or commit ID, you will get a message from Git that reads something like, you are in detached head state. The reason Git gets nervous is because you have placed head in the middle of the DAG somewhere and you're not on the tip of any branch. As a result, if you were to make changes now and commit them, such a commit would be accessible only by its checksum ID. Remember that Git uses labels internally to keep track of where things are, and each branch has a label that points to its most recent commit, in other words, the tip of the branch. You have now moved the head label to a commit that does not have any branch label on it, so from Git's point of view, you're not currently on a branch, and if you were to make changes here, they would be added to the DAG, but without a label, you could only ever reference them by their internal ID. To get out of this situation, you have two options. You can check out any other branch, which will move the head label back to the tip of that branch, which in turn means that head is no longer detached. Or you can create a branch where you are right now, which will mean head will, no, will now be on the tip of your newly created branch and thus will also no longer be detached. Whichever options you choose, a detached head state is not a good place to make changes. So if you just want to look around without changing anything, that's fine. But if you plan to add commits, you should really start by creating a branch first.